Hello collective, thanks for tuning in to my channel. This is your girl, Truth Be Told, Divine Messages 11 and 11. I also go by Raw and Uncut, aka Spiritual Savage. Thanks for tuning in with me. Thanks for following me on um, YouTube. Thanks for following me on Facebook. And thanks for following me on um, Instagram. Make sure y'all hit that, um, that notification bell so y'all can get alerted when I um, upload a video. Okay, make sure you subscribe to my channel. To all of my um, my followers that have been following me since day one, thank you for rocking out with your girl. Thanks for viewing and sharing my videos. Thanks for all the support for my new subscribers. Welcome to my world. I am truthfully told my cards do not lie here. Okay. Um, I am blunt sometimes, so don't get offended. You know, I'm just going by what my ancestors say. Sometimes they be mad. Sometimes they be happy. Okay. I read energy and aura. Okay. Thanks for tuning into my channel. So this message is um, for the collective. Okay, I was doing a reading on Facebook earlier. Okay, and um, all we kept seeing was basically the apology <clears throat> sign. Okay, somebody wants to come back from the past. Okay, I feel like this is a past person energy. And they're feeling very regretful of how they treated you or what they said to you. Um, okay, so we're going to get in here and see. Look, these, these, these. It, it keeps falling, guys. So I'm gonna have to go into that tea leaf. Okay. Um, I'm gonna go in here and check this person energy out and see what's going on. Okay, I feel like this person is holding on to you tight. Okay, but you you are in your nine of pentacles energy right now. Okay, you are not in you are in your nine of pentacles energy. Like this person even sees you in your nine of um pentacles energy. Okay, this person can feel as though that you're moving on for them and they trying to um they trying to hold on really tight for you, okay? This person could be going through money issues right now, okay? But I feel as though that you, you and this person is not talking right now. This person is watching you, okay? They can be stalking your page, riding past your house, spying on you, okay? This person is, I don't feel like you you, you and this person is, is communicating, okay? I feel as though that you swam to calmer waters, okay? Because something was going on in this connection that rub your fellas the wrong way collective but this person over here feels so that you're getting away from them okay this person does not like that you guys are not speaking right now this person do not like that you're in this non um pinnacles energy which is single okay this person is deeply in love with you okay i feel as though that you do you guys have a strong connection towards each other okay now this can be um a libra Gem gemini or aquarius Okay, I don't do um, signs here, so take the rose how you see fit. Okay, I read energy and aura. Okay, but this person wants to come towards you with some communication about something that have happened in the past, okay, that they are holding on to. This person is holding on to this truth. They know they got to come and tell you the truth, but this person doesn't know how to approach you because obviously you block this person you block all communication from this person and this person this is why this person is spying on you trying to figure out um when they can come and give you this truth see this is you collective you pop out as the queen of um the queen of wands and the empress okay you are very intuitive you are very smart you are very loving you are very down on earth you are very intuitive you are very naturing okay and this person missed that about you i feel as though that um this person is going under some judgment and some karma right now because of how they treated you i feel like this person is trapped in a situation yeah boom yeah this person is trapped into a karmic cycle okay that they left you for okay and this person is heartbreaking this person is heartbreaking this this person um wants to chase you i feel like this is a twin flame connection okay especially with the chaser card here this person feel like you're leaving them behind this person is, this person has fear of um this person have codependent issues okay this person has abandonment issues okay this person did put you in a, um, a karmic situation okay this person is, is saying i'm not a player i just fuck a lot okay so this person um went towards somebody Went, went towards a, a person, okay, that they thought that the grass was greener on the other side. And it came, it, 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 and this person found out that it, it was not as green as it may look. They got over there and it was food gold, baby. They, that grass was fake. 
Okay, this keeps coming out in a readings. Okay, this person does not want to let go from you. This person is holding on to this connection really tight with you. Okay, this person can be having money issues. Okay, but I feel as though that this person left you for somebody that they thought that you had, that, that they thought that they had more money than you. Okay, or they can they can put them in a better position, I'm hearing. Okay. I feel like this is a deep level commitment right here with this current relationship, okay? I feel like you guys is mirroring each other at one point, okay? But this person is stuck in a lot of codependent issues right now, okay? This person is codependent on this karmic that they're with, okay? This person knows that they made the wrong choice. This is probably why this person is holding on to you like that, okay? This is probably why this person is holding on to you. Yeah, because you are very intuitive, collective. You are standing in a lot of pinnacles, with the high priestess and you're the queen of wands with the empress you're very intuitive you're very yo you whoever i'm speaking to you are a very beautiful young lady or um you are a very beautiful um divine masculine take your rose how you see fit you could be on this side collective but you could be on this side okay but this person over here is going through it okay this person know that they made the wrong decision they feel like they're stuck in this karmic situation Nothing is going good in their favor. They're under, um, they are they getting a karma right now. This person is heartbroken of how they treated you. I feel like this person was was giving you signals and red flags of mad narcissistic ways. I feel like at one point this person wanted you to chase them, okay? Because this is this is I feel like this is this is that energy that this person was always putting you in. This person would come in and out of your life. This person always wanted uh wanted you to chase them, not giving you com clear communication. Okay, but spirit is telling me that this person is talking to you tele telepathically right now, but I feel as though that you guys this person blocked out. Okay, cuz something that something happened with this um this person. Something happened um with this person in this karmic situation. Okay? This person like this person is all up in their head, okay? This person is saying just let me go. Um yeah, this is a high level commitment right here. Okay, so I feel as though that you and this person was together for a long time, or you guys could have been engaged with each other. Okay, and I feel as though that um you this person did not walk away from a situation that they were supposed to walk away from. Okay, I've been picking up on this energy for the past two days. This person is heartbroken of how they, they treated you. And I'm here on Valentine's Day. This person, I feel like this person is trying to come through on Valentine's Day, or they're gonna contact you on Valentine's Day, okay. This person want to come forward and tell you the truth about this third party situation and about their player ways and about they coded they coded pitted issues and their toxic decisions. Okay, this person, this person came to a realization. This person has a, a, a inner knowing of what this community, what this relationship is. Okay, this person do not want to let this go. Okay, this person feels so that you left them out on a cold. Okay, but I'm with spirit is just saying to me that you know. The, the only thing that's happening right now is um the same thing that uh you this the same thing that this person did to you the person that they left you for is doing to them okay so that's that's what spirit is saying okay this person I feel like you and this person had a high level of commit commitment with each other okay this was like a, a destined to be all be all and this person knew that this person is getting broken um this person is getting downloads about the situation now this person. This person knew now that they walked away from the wrong person. And I feel as though this person is trying to um, walk away from the karma, but the karma is not happening. Okay. This person is unclear and confused. I feel like, no. At one time, this person was very confused about what was going on. It was unsure of the relationship. Okay. But it's like every time like they hurt you, they hurt themselves. Okay. I feel like this karmic is picking up on this energy between you guys. Okay. And, and like this, this, this karmic is... This karmic is confused also because I feel like this karmic did everything. And yeah, this this karmic was trying to put the work in or whatever for them to forget about you. But all this person keep thinking about is you, collective. Okay? Like, I feel like you're not confused no more about this situation with the high, with the, um, high priestess here. you just working on yourself right now. Completely. Yeah. Because something has been... um. Something has been exposed to you, okay? I feel like this person could be in jail, or so this person could be watched, or this person can have um court cases with this FBI card here, okay? I feel like somebody is watching. Somebody is, is watching. Somebody heavy, 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 okay? And I feel like you, when you walked away from this person, a lot of things um came out about this person that they were trying to keep secret, okay? And I feel like the community is talking about this for some reason, Okay? 
Yeah, because this person wasn't going with their intuition. This person wasn't, you know, this person wasn't listening to themselves. This person was going against the grain. I'm here. This person is waiting for you to contact them or um, you could be waiting for them to contact you. Okay, but what I'm hearing is Spirit is saying that this person is waiting for you to contact them. Okay, this person and also this person is waiting for spirit to give give them the green light. But what I'm hearing is spirit 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 is not finished with them yet. Spirit is not finished with them yet, okay? I feel like this person was really stuck in this devilish ass energy given to you and everybody else. Okay, this person was hard-headed ass. You see this king of swords, he's sitting on that hard ass throne over here. Okay, this person was very cutthroat with their words. Okay? I feel like some things that this person said have broke your heart. Some things that you have found out about this person broke your heart. And it just it just was a massacre. Okay. Now I really do feel like this is a marriage. Okay. Yeah, this person was in and out of your life. Okay. Now this person wanna rush in and you just passionate um this offer. Okay. But you feel like it's too many burdens here. Collective, like, you feel like it's too many burdens here. This person have put you through a lot. Okay. This person feel like they left out in a cold i feel like at one time this person did leave you out in a cold but spirit told you to move along and you know the five of pentacles of right is somebody that's being left out in the cold okay but i'm getting there um you're not left out in the cold no more you understand what's going on okay i feel like this person is being left out in the cold about this by these people that they left you for or these people that they was entertaining mm. I feel like whatever this, whatever whatever this person did to you, okay, these these karmics that this 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 person has in their life is doing it to them right now. Now this person wanna come in and offer you this cup. They wanna rush in with this emotional um offer and this passionate offer, but you gotta understand they coming in the night, so like it's not really a stable offer if you ask me. It's like in and out like this person don't know what they want to do they in their head they don't know who they want to be with it's unclear about what they want to do right now okay this person is is very emotional about you collective right now this person is heart is breaking 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 that's all i keep hearing this person know that they made the wrong choice this person saying that they was in an illusion that they don't want none of them options that they chose you off of okay they understand this connection now, but, you know, this person has so too many choices. This person has too many choices, and I feel like they miss all the signs that Spirit was sending them about you, okay? Um, this person definitely want to come in and put in the work in, but collective, I feel like this is you putting the work in um, for this new beginning right here because judgment was called on this situation, okay? And um, this person has been wondering what you've been up to lately. That's why I say I know that you're not talking. Okay, you over here is evolving into a butterfly. Okay, you you already hit your caterpillar stage. You are healing. You are healing yourself. You are um, releasing the past. You are healing your old wounds. Okay, you just doing what's best for you right now. Okay, spirit told you to go left and you went left collective. You got on that boat and you took your kids or your family or whatever you had. And you smooth, you 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 sell to common waters because you wasn't beat. It was too many burdens here. Okay, this person was scared of commitment. Okay, when all you wanted this person to do was commit and tell you the truth. Okay, this person was giving you empty promises. Okay, you and this person can have kids together, or this person could have made a child with somebody else. Yeah, it's a possibility that this child is not theirs, and this person want a second chance that they're saying. Okay, this person just want to make a. This person want to just make amends and, and come in with the opportunity to make this right, but this person cannot come towards you right now with this knight of swords. I mean, with this Knight of Pentacles in reverse, this person is having a lot of money problems, okay? I'm hearing that um, this person is having car troubles, too, okay? I feel like this person is getting really mad because they can't move towards you or they can't... They, they, it's like they can't move towards you right now, collective, because you got the King of... You got the Knight of Pentacles in reverse with the Seven of... Um, Cups in reverse with the five of pentacles in reverse. This person can't come towards you. This person feels like they're stuck. But I feel like um, spirit is blocking this... Um, 
spirit is blocking this union because this person has to go through judgment. I feel like this person put you through a lot. And also, I feel as though that this person also can be in jail because you got judgment right here with FBI right here in reverse. So I feel like this person is being watched by the feds or the FBI. Yeah, because um, justice has to be served. And I feel like this is the justice system. So this person can, for some of you, this person is in jail. Okay, for um, most of you guys, okay, this person is in spiritual jail. Okay, for some of you guys, this person is being watched by somebody. This could be people, their family, or these karmics, or this person can be watch get being watched by the police. Okay, I feel like, like I said, I feel like this person is trapped in a situation. This person feel like they're trapped into this karmic situation that they put themselves in and they don't know how to walk away from this person. But Spirit is saying like the same thing that they did to you, they got to um, they gotta do to this karmic. They got to cut these karmics off in order to get a new beginning with you because they're not going to let it happen. Spirit is not going to let it happen. Okay, I feel like you're very intuitive. Okay, I feel like this person... This person is mad. This person is stuck in their head. Okay. If you don't have kids with this person, this person wish they could have um had kids with you. Okay. This this person want a new opportunity with you. But let me tell you something collective. This person is definitely going to take a risk and a chance to um contact you. So what spirit is telling me is that when this person do contact you or whatever, they probably going to rush in with this communication. It's going to sound out of balance because this person is rushing in. Um very emotional right now this person is rushing in very emotional because they feel like you're slipping away okay and this person is tired of taking their time okay they're tired of taking their time not coming to you and, and, and letting you know what's going on because this person feel like you, this person don't even feel your energy no more for like this i feel like this person hurt you so bad you cut all communication off with them you probably change your number okay you probably moved you probably change your shit up, your style up. But Spirit is saying this person is not dealing with nobody right now. This person is trying to cut all these third parties off. But some of these, but yeah, and that's the damn truth. This, this person is trying to cut all the third parties off right now. Okay, so if you want this person back, collective, this person is coming back to tell you the truth. Okay, Spirit is saying this, you know, if you want this person back, Okay, just, you know, this person is going to come back and tell you the truth, but this person is going to be an emotional truth. It could be a text. It could be a call. It could be a pop-up. It could be an email. It could be anything, but this person is going to try to contact you. So get ready for a message, okay? And Spirit wants you to, um, Spirit saying that, um, understand that this person at that time had an old, an old train of thought of thinking, okay, and it's like this person got all these patterns, um, replaying in their head about what they did to you, okay, yeah, with memories, this person is sitting here, um, remin reminiscing about all the things that y'all have been through, okay, and this person, is, yeah, this person loves you, okay, and they, and they mad that they put you in so much conflict in this relationship, and they feel as though they, um, they feel as if they know that they did you fucked up, collective spirit is saying. They know that they did you fucked up. They know that they didn't have to do this to you like that, okay? But the spirit is, like, really drilling this person with memories of you, okay, of, and how they treated you. And this is exactly why this person want to come in with this, um, as this page of Pentacles energy and give you this, um, this commitment, this they will offer her this message about something, okay? But I feel like this, this person is trying to offer you this other Pentacle to, because you already sitting in there and you're not a Pentacle, you already need one more Pentacle to, um, make it to the Ten of Pentacles. But I feel like, though, that you can make it to the Ten of Pentacles on your own if you wanted to, okay? And this person knows that. Okay, this person is mad. This person is mad that they did not take your cup when you offered it to them collective. They is so upset that they not they did not take this cup. Okay, you got the four with the five. They they is mad. They don't want nothing from nobody else. They don't want to talk to these karmics. They are pulling their energy back from this karma. Yeah, because keep it arrow. They love you. Now they want to come in and be faithful to you. Now they want to um commit to you now they want you to have faith they say that they they want to come and put their pride and ego to the side and come and make it work with you okay okay and they want to come in fast they want to come in fast but they don't know they don't know if you put the depth to the situation but they want to come back and rebirth the situation collective spirit is saying that 
I know that you in your head about this situation, but it's up to you. Cause like it's up to you to see what you want to do. Okay. Spirit is saying when, when this person do come back. Okay. If you don't want to talk to this person, tell this person that you don't want to talk to them, that you don't need their closure or whatever the case may be. Just break it down to them or whatever, so they won't be thinking that um that y'all moving somewhere with this. Okay. And another thing is, Spirit is saying, if you want this person back, this person is going through an ascension right now, a spiritual awakening and dark night of the soul, okay? This person understands the connection, but this person understands that they got to cut all these third parties off, and they got to come out of that devilish energy and get out of the, and heal that that um, that um inner childhood wounded and these codependent issues and these, these um devilish toxic addictions that they have in order to come to you they gotta put a death to some shit they gotta make a sacrifice to come to you and i'm not saying about people i'm just saying about ways okay so don't get it twisted collective okay this person he has to make a sacrifice he has to release his old his old train of thought his old way of thinking in order to come towards you because you're not about that look how vibrant you you are you, you're not about that you're healing you're walking in your abundance. You're understanding who you are. You're putting yourself first. You're sitting on your throne, okay? All you was asking this person was for love anyway. And this person is sitting here saying that they love you. And they're sorry how they treated you, okay? This person knows that you're upset. This person knows that you put boundaries up. And I feel like every time this person try to um, either communicate with you, I feel like you put your energy back and you put your boundaries up. And this person feel that in your energy, okay? This person knows that you are a boss-ass bitch, okay? First of all, so they don't even know why they played you like that. Like, yeah, they tried it. They want to be inside you. They missing you sexually, physically, emotionally. Like, this person just can't get over you. I feel like even if they is having sex with other people, it's not doing the job. It's not good enough. They dick won't even get hard. They pussy won't get weird. Sorry for my language, but it's just the truth, yeah. Okay? But I feel like this person want to come and rebirth this thing to you, rebirth this relationship with you, and come and give you this stable offer. But understand that they come in, all, they come in with, the, with the page of pinnacles, so they probably don't have a lot. They probably don't have a lot to offer you. Because in the beginning, they, it came out as the four of pinnacles. This person could be having money problems. Okay? So this person want to come and rebuild this with you with another stable offer, but it's a page of pinnacles. And then you had the knight of pinnacles in reverse. Something was stopping this person. And I really feel as though it was these karmics, these karmics things that was all around him okay so what else spirit yeah this person please please don't want you to go i feel like before this person was just saying please just let me go just let me go because they didn't understand the connection they didn't they thought that whoever they chose you over was the deal and they, and they went over there and it was fool's goal now this person understanding connection because spirit eliminated it for them okay and called justice and judgment on a situation and illuminated to them about who you was which is the empress and the high priestess and now this person saying like a damn dude a, a damn fool now this person want to go deep within and look at the different viewpoints about y'all yeah I, I feel like these car makes that his family or her family is talking shit about y'all the community is talking shit about y'all but see collective you in the clear because now this person has been exposed about their narcissistic ways and now people understanding what was really going on in in the, in the connection okay yeah this person wanted it at all. The, after I'm hearing though, I'm hearing that this person was a good talker. Okay, this person, this this person, this is the type of person that can um talk you out your motherfucking boxes or your panties. I'm hearing. Okay, the, yeah, this person was an in and out person. This person liked it a lot of conflict, but I'm hearing that this person did this to any and everybody that they came across. But when they met you collective, you changed their whole motherfucking world. You turned it up. You turned their world upside down because let me tell you something. God favored you, and they did not know whoever this person was they did not know that god rocks with you like that okay and i feel as though that you were you was talking to this person about um spiritual awakenings and twin flames and soulmates and this person didn't believe in nothing that you motherfuckers said but spirit said let me move collective out the way so i can give collective or what she really need god is about to listen let me tell you something if you want this person collective this this person is coming back new and improved baby Okay, this person going to be a little rougher by the edges, but spirit said, you know how to work this person. You know how to work them edges out this person. Okay, now if you want this relationship, I, I see that it's going to be, um, I see that it's going to blossom into a new relationship because this person is going to definitely come back and put the work in this time. Okay, after all the bullshit that they did, but like spirit said, you have a, you have a free will to be with this person or not. Okay, um, if you don't want to be with this person, you know. Tell this person that how it is, how you feel, and just keep it moving. But I'm feeling like this person don't want to be friends with you. Yeah. 
I feel like you don't even want to be with this person anymore. And this person feels as though that you closed the chapter with them. Okay, this person feels like they self-sabotage this relationship. I feel as though that this person feels as though that you got your boundaries so up. It's like, don't even fucking come my way. Like, seriously. Like, damn, what did this person do? Mm. Spirit, can I have a couple more, please? Yeah, this person wanted to be very ignorant. Wanted to, this person was a people pleaser. This person loved material things. This person wanted to be a all, all see all every up in everybody faces. Okay, it was all about the it was all about the money with this person. It was sex and money with this person. Sex, money, and stability with this person. But see, that's what I'm saying. Like this person didn't know you had the whole shebang over here. That's the thing. This person was lusting for other people when they could have been lusting and working it out with you. Like, that's, that's so weird to me. Okay, what's the last one? Yeah, this person want to come in and get you pregnant. This person want to have a family with you. And also, the message that I'm hearing, this person could have probably slipped up and had um and got somebody else pregnant. Mm, damn. Okay. All right, Spirit. Can you tell me what's going on? With this energy over here. Okay. This person is finally understanding your self-worth. Okay. This person want um, to come in and put in the work. But this person is healing a shadow side right now. While you're healing yourself. The spirit wants you to know that you and this person was marrying each other. Y'all were self-reflecting on each other. Um, inner wounds. Okay. This person is going deep within and trying to heal that. Trying to heal these abandonment issues. What have happened to them in their past. Okay. Right now, this person can be feeling really depressed right now. Of the thought of losing you. This person can be feeling sick. This person... This I'm feeling like this person don't even get out of bed. Yeah, because this person was fucking a narcissist. Okay, all this, this was it was a one one sided relationship. Okay, I feel like at, at one point you felt as though that this person was self assertive. This because this person was love bombing the relationship, just telling you what you wanted to hear. Okay, there was no healthy choices here. Okay, spirit is saying you chose yourself collective, and you since you chose yourself. You started to be happy. You started to love your life. Okay? It's like self-love, self-care. Okay? And I feel like a lot of people are mad at you about that because you're not chasing behind this person. And you're not making it. It's like you're not you're not making it a problem. Like, you're not trying. I feel like before when, when shit was happening, okay, you made it. You, you was putting your neck out there for this person. But I feel like this time around, you stepped back. You step back because this person was taking too many chances with your heart. They was gambling with your heart. They wasn't showing their hand. They was pulling their emotions back. They was playing games with your heart. They was lying about, love bombing you. And I feel as though that as you sit back and spirit told you to sit back, um, you saw the narcissist ways in this person. But I, 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 I tell you no lie, spirit set this person down. Yeah, because this person feel like, um, yeah, you moved away from this person. You moved away from this person because it, 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 I feel like this relationship was very toxic, okay? It was very one-sided, okay? This person was not giving you what you was ditching now. There was no progress here. Like I said, this person want to contact you collective. This person want to send you a message. This person want to call you. But it give you this clarity and give you this truth. But they don't know how you're going to... Um, they don't know how you're going to take it because they really feel as though that the relationship is over. That is a deficit situation. I am truth be told. Thanks for tuning into my channel. See you later, guys.